Once upon a time when things were rotten, not just food but also cakes were rotten. Everybody kicked the peasants. Things were bad and that ain't good. Then came Robin Hood. Papa, soon a band of merry men he got. They wore out the made of plain green cotton, helping victims plunge their business. Boy, oh boy, was business good. They drank, they jumped a lot of fences. They robbed the rich, get to the poor, except when they get more expenses. So when other legends are forgotten, we'll remember back when things were rotten. approaches, Your Highness. What do you mean, Your Highness? I'm not Your Highness. I'm a prince. My brother Richard is Your Highness. I am nothing. As you wish. A courier approaches your nothingness. Right. Hmm? <laughs> oh, no! I just had that floor waxed. <laughs> Fuck that man to smithereens! I'm a heavenly. I bear a message most important from King Richard the Lionheart. Oh, yeah? Well, how do we know it's from him, huh? My dear pea brain. Oh, that's him. He's the only one who ever used to call me that. <laughs> I have been captured and imprisoned by Archduke Archibald, the Archduke of Austria, and I'm destined to be executed in two weeks. Oh, boy, it's good news. Wait. However... I knew there was a catch to it. The ransom of 20,000 gold sovereigns is paid to my emissary upon his arrival in Nottingham. My life will be spared. Your loving brother, the king, and don't you forget it. <laughs> P.S. Sorry about the floor. <laughs> Wonderful. We don't pay the ransom, and Richard will be pushing up daisies, and I will be king. Exactly. By your leave, my liege. What message should I give the emissary? Tell the emissary to come. We shall collect the ransom. May I speak with you, Sheriff? <laughs> Crazy! We pay the ransom, Richard will live, and I won't be king! And I want to have my own country! And I want to put my face on a stamp! My liege, I only said we would collect the ransom. I never said we would deliver it. Oh. oh I get it. I get it. Oh, you're so bright, Herbert. That's Hubert. Well, both of you are bright. <laughs> Pea brain. <laughs> And on behalf of myself and our beloved ruler, who is too distraught to speak to you today. Pea brain. We beg of you once again, dig deep and tighten that belt one more notch. And to strip yourself of your very last farthing, to ransom our revered king, revered, revered king Richard. We would lay down our very lives to show our loyalty to King Richard. But how can we be sure that the ransom will be paid? You have the word of Prince John himself and the sacred pledge of Hubert, Lord High Sheriff of Nottingham. Oh, oh my ears deceive me. Are you saying you do not trust us? Yes! Yeah. I see. But for some reason, you have no faith in either the prince or in me. Very well. Then pick someone of your own choosing to guard the ransom. We choose the most trusted and honest man in the kingdom. Me, Robin Hood. So be it. 
Robin Hood will guard King Richard's ransom. Get word to him. May I have a word with you, Sheriff? Are you crazy? <laughs> Robin Hood? Trust my treachery, sire. If everything goes according to my plan, we will have the gold, Robin Hood will be executed, King Richard will be dead, and you will be king. Brilliant, my sheriff. It's like killing four gonsets with one funding. Oh, I get to get rid of four gonsets. <laughs> You weren't going to the castle, Robin. I smell a trap. I can't listen to your nose, little John. My life is of little importance when King Richard hangs in the balance. And you query why this man rules the metropolitan forest and its suburbs? Is it his courage? Is it his bravery? Is it his boldness? Or is it all of the above? <laughs> Robin, please, be careful. I'm only doing what any loyal Englishman must do. Boy. For once, I'm glad I'm a resident alien. <laughs> Robin, wear this close to your heart. It will nourish the spirit. Thank you, Friar. And use this if you have to. It will knock a man senseless. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Alan. Robin. I'm sure I speak for all the merry men when I say... Alan, please. <laughs> Thank you. Ronaldo, say goodbye. Goodbye, Robin. No, not to me, to them. You're going with me. What? Did I forget to tell you? I really hate traveling alone. Ordinarily, I would consider this a great honor. Except I'm in mortal fear of losing my life. <laughs> Lay aside your fears, my son, for he rides with you. Say, Padre, I'll lay aside my fears. And my life, my lord. Bernardo, men, I want you to station yourselves outside the castle. We may need you on a moment's notice. Yeah, and when we call, please don't put us on hold. <laughs> Have a wonderful time. Come on, Bones. Baby wants a new pair of chickens. Dragon's eyes. <laughs> oh, too bad. You've landed on Merlin Garden. Not good for you, Prince John. I have four castles, two huts, and one tavern. Let's see. You owe me. Oh, no! Where's those fours again? You are an hour early. You must be excited about spending the evening with us. Not really. I would sooner spend my evening talking to an English muffin. Dost it. <laughs> However, we have more important things to do this night than to engage in worthless repartee with the royal jackal and his obedient cur. Sheriff! You're not talking. I'm not? No. Oh, thank you. <laughs> worthless repartee, indeed. Well. This is one English muffin you'll regret having burned. <laughs> but this is no time to talk of breakfast. To the treasury room. 19,997, 19,998, 19,999, 20,000. Well, peasant, how say you? It is all here, Sheriff. 20,000 gold sovereigns. I shall go and tell the peasants. Hold! Before you join the rabble, let us make certain the ransom is safe. Are not these walls and these floors of solid stone? Yes, my lord. And this door, is it not of case-hardened English steel? Yes, <laughs> yes my lord. Do you see any other entrances or exits from this room? No, my lord. Have we ever met before? Yes, you're the sheriff. Of course. Hey, man, we're not renting an apartment here. We're just staying the night. My only concern was for the safety of King Richard's ransom. Well, then, you'd better leave. We wouldn't want any shifty-looking characters lurking about now, would we? <laughs> now be off and allow us to begin our vigil. So be it. <laughs> Proceed. Hello, <laughs> 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 
peasants! Robin Hood stands guard over the ransom! Yeah! We have only but to await the arrival of the emissary, and good King Richard will be well on the road to Rio! Freedom! <laughs> Your bedtime, Sire, but we must be. Well, there's no problem here. Let's go. Room service. Robin, it's your cookie with a cake. <laughs> Marion, it's dangerous for you to be seen here. I fear not for my own safety, but for yours. I bring you sustenance. <laughs> oh, thank you, Marion. Be alert, Robin. I will. If they want to steal the gold tonight, they'll have to steal me with it. For tonight, the ransom place shall be my resting chest. Um, I'm going to sleep on it, Miriam. Oh, too bad they didn't put the gold in a nice, comfy bed for you. Uh, this side. Oh, ma'am. She's as sweet as her sustenance. How are you going to do it? How are you going to get the gold? Not to worry, my liege. My plan is not only flawless, it is foolproof. Yeah, but will it work? <laughs> That's the main thing. <laughs> Stay awake. Guard the gold. Stay away. I'm away. I'm away. I The king's emissary has arrived. Uh, you men, take this ransom to the throne room. Oh, no, you don't. You're a fool to think I'd let anyone else touch this chest. Ronaldo? <laughs> On the other hand, if you guys really want to pitch in. <laughs> Robin Hood, Sir Blondel, King Richard's emissary. Sir Blondel, behold this. That which we have guarded with our lives, the ransom of King Richard the Lionhearted. You would ransom our king with these? <laughs> they're just rocks. Yeah, but uh, they're just rocks, but they're pretty nice rocks, you have to admit that. Like the one you have in your hand. Man, that's granite. And that's water. These are very hard to find. You please. No. Oh, Robin, how could you? He has finally shown his true colors as a traitor and a thief. I am innocent. And before you now, I accuse the sheriff and Prince John of treachery to the throne of King Richard. Yeah, I see no treachery here but your own, Robin of Loxley. And having vested in me King Richard's power of attorney and death, I decree that you shall pay for this treachery with your lives. <laughs> Execute them! Of noble birth, and as such, I have the right to prove my innocence. By what rule? The, uh, the golden rule. Do unto others. No, 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 golden rule. I want to see an execution. No. No, wait. We have nothing to lose and only King Richard's life to gain. Let Robin Hood play his charade and produce the ransom if he can. Can I have a word with you, Sheriff? Are you wacko? We had him. Now, if Robin finds the ransom, I won't be king. Rest your brains, my page. I have ingeniously hidden the ransom where Robin will never find it. Oh, Hubert, you are such a smart -o. And you look good in black, too. <laughs> Prince John agrees. Uh, does it meet with your approval, Sir Blondel? Oh, yes, yes, anything. You have till sunrise, Robin of Loxley. At which time I shall leave this castle with the ransom or your head. I opt for the former. Is the former keeping or not keeping the head? 
keeping. Put two down for the former. And now show me to my chambers. I have had a wearying journey and am eager for sleep. Hey, man, there are 748 rooms in this castle. How are we going to search all of them in four hours? Some of the men, Ronaldo. I want them here as quickly as possible. Want to talk about a moment's notice? <laughs> Alan, please. Men, we must find the gold before sunrise. I want you to search everything and everybody. Little John, you start here. Here. Friar Tuck, you take the north wing. Ronaldo, the south. Alan, you search the lounge area. Never get the big room. <laughs> spiritual guidance did I chop cupcakes my son for I'm about to make this water holy <laughs> But this is done in my chambermaid. Not now, Ronaldo. Time is precious. Every moment counts. Oh, Lord! Provide us with guidance. Revitalize us with faith. Give us a clue! Look! The clue! The crack! The crack is the clue! Stand back from the crack! <laughs> Is this what the emissary of the king must put up with? First a bed as hard as iron, and now this infernal racket? What is this, the why? <laughs> My apologies, sir. Guard! Show the emissary to more comfortable quarters. Oh, sir, thank you. I do hate to watch executions when I'm tired and cranky. <laughs> Warm? Warmer? Ooh, ah! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I rabble. Hi. <laughs> Let me show you what your trusted friend Robin has come up with so far. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I'm sorry. May I help you? <laughs> Did you find anything in the moat, little John? Anybody want to buy a duck? <laughs> little John, what are you doing? You said to search everything and everybody. Two demerits, right? Right. Mm -hmm. I try. Heaven knows, I try. The overzealous fool. He should have known that the only treasure in this room is you. Oh, Robin, that's what I love most about you. You're honest. <laughs> Robin, morning draws near. Yes. And we with no ransom to show for our efforts. Perhaps now that the Lord Emissary is in more comfortable quarters, he will sleep late and give you more time to look. 
No, I'm afraid the Lord Emissary will... Wait a minute. What you just said. I must away. Thank you, my darling. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. The sun rises. And Bertram, the game is over. He did not pass go, and he did not collect 20,000 gold sovereigns. I would say that this game has been called on account of death. Robins. Robin of Loxley, having failed to find the ransom, in the name of King Richard, I sentence you to be shot through the heart by an arrow or killed, whichever comes first. Wonderful. Multiple choice. Archers, proceed with the execution. This is an outrage. Are we to stand idly by while murder is done? No! no! Archers, fasten arrows. <laughs> Robin, what are the little guys for? I guess that's in case we duck. Draw your bowstrings! Ready! Aim! Wait! Don't we at least get a chance to say farewell? All right, all right, but hurry it up. The grave diggers are on golden time. <laughs> Farewell, lovely Marion. It's a pity we didn't get a chance to know each other better. Friar. Bless you, my son. Robin, do you have anything up your sleeve? No sleeves. <laughs> Goodbye, Ellen. You big palooka. I'm sure I speak for all the merry men. What did I say? Alan, say it. <laughs> Be strong, big guy. And farewell to you, faithful armor of doom, King Richard. I have failed you. Bye-bye. King Richard's ransom! That's the first place I looked! It was empty! I know, little John. I brought the ransom here from its resting place. And just where was this resting place? Your resting place. The place upon which you could find no rest. My resting place? How did it get there? I'm sure I don't know. Do you, Sheriff? Well, I... <laughs> Everyone <laughs> home? I must leave now. But I assure you that news of these events will reach King Richard's ear. Yes, he must know the deeds that Prince John performs in his absence. Oh. Good deeds indeed, for I have seen him dispense justice with an even hand in allowing you to prove your innocence. <laughs> Have a word with you, Sheriff, please. <laughs> the sheriff's archers didn't shoot you full of little holes? You think you're glad? You should see the smile on this guy's face. I'm glad too, Robin. If she wanted a holy man, she could have dated Friar Tuck. A <laughs> crusader grand for Robin Hood from King Richard. Yes, Sylvester. Wait, I'll need identification. Good enough. <laughs> oh, it's a singing crusader grand. Here, Alan, you've got the pipes for this. Hit it. Dear Robin of Loxley, my ransom arrived in gold. I'm immersed. You were a few sovereigns over, so I bought some knock worse. <laughs> the dungeon was dirty and dismal and damp. If you plan to stop by, take the Stuttgart off ramp. One more time! <laughs> Got it. <laughs> 